I am so angry. I am flabbergasted. I am so infuriated. Why didn't you guys tell me about this kid right here? I want some rest. Are we having fun yet? Can we stop? Stop trying to give away our picks, please, for the love of God. I've seen so many people say, you know, I'll just give it, I'll just get rid of it. I'm okay with getting rid of some picks, you know. You know we can get rid of this 2024 pick uh, if we want, you know. You just get rid of Just throw it away. Throw it away. Get, get rid of our top four pick, and let, let's get DeJounte Murray. Can we stop? Stop, for the love of my, oh my God. I don't, I am so angry, guys. I, so this kid, I knew a little bit about him because people talked about him, I think about a couple years ago. Um, it was like right after everyone started talking about Wimby, they mentioned this kid. And I, I, I didn't look into it. I'll be honest. I'll be completely transparent. I was so keyed in on Wimby. Um, I'm very new to the college scene, so I'm trying my best to get familiar with like different college players. I just became a North Carolina fan. Go. Tar Heels, yeah, my, my, my boy got me on it. Thank you, Swish Hill. Um, but yeah, so I, I'm very new to these things, right? So when it comes to like players we can draft, um, I've only been really looking into it the past two years. Um, but this is a kid I just didn't, I, I didn't know, I didn't know, I was not familiar with his game. He is so freaking good right now. I think he's being projected at what the, the god is like seventh, he's getting projected as seventh. God, guys, I'm telling you this right now. I mean, obviously, I got way more people to, to look into. Um, like, I'm really liking that Castle kid. But th this dude right here, I would not be angry with the Spurs whatsoever if they went ahead and took him uh, uh, two, three. I, I don't care. He is so freaking fluid. Um, I actually looked through one of his games. I'm going to watch another one. I think he plays the Austin Spurs. I, when I'm recording this, he'll be playing the Austin Spurs tomorrow. So I'll be watching that after the Spurs game. But this kid, dude, oh my goodness. He has so much in his bag. It's absolutely crazy how good he is. So first and foremost, um, if you're wondering what his size is, he's 6'10". Okay, and I know what you're thinking. Well, 6'10", Clan, he's, he's getting power forward. Well, he was actually slotted at power forward. And as the season went on, they slotted him in small forward and he looked really impressive okay so we can actually have him as small forward um if we'd like but yeah so he's 6'10 209 pounds i think he might have been listed a little bit higher on something else i saw but he is so freaking versatile so you can see here as far as his shooting is concerned because that's what everyone cares about um not 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 wonderful on paper right now not wonderful on paper you got to kind of uh watch him but numbers yeah, you're like, uh, that's that's not that that's not that impressive, clan. So we can look at actually, we'll just split it up. So regular season thus far with six games played, uh, it is 32.8 percent. Oh, terrible! What is that? That's terrible. But you can also see he averaged a steal and he averaged 1.5 blocks, uh, five rebounds. Very versatile and so many things in his bag. And there's a lot he can kind of grow up or, or, or uh, build upon. And then as we can see here, if we go with the showcase, 13.3 uh, points, uh, much better, 48.2% field goal percentage. Can still do better. Obviously, you want to be over 50, um, but you know, it is what it is. 22% three, not, not great, not great. But you can see here, 1.3 steals, 1.4 blocks. So he has the defense. He's very fluid. He has the length. He has the size. And he's only 19 years old. Dude, I, I am just blown away by this kid. Uh, when I was watching, I was just... I just didn't understand why there's not a lot of talk about him. I, I don't understand it at all. I saw, I saw, and Swish brought this up too, uh, to me, but I, I ended up seeing the comments about him because I looked him up and there were a lot of people saying, well, he, he's uh, stiff. I don't know where that's coming from. If anything, the guy that a lot of Spurs fans uh, love, Nikola Topic, he looks a little bit more stiff. And even he's a beast, but he looks a little bit more stiff. This kid is not stiff. He is smooth. He is silky, man. He does a great job of, of avoiding contact, but he can also posterize you at any given moment. He has the handles. He has the he has the size. He has the defense. I mean, he has so many things in his bag. I am angry with you guys that you would be willing to just throw away picks. Just it's just it's just throw it away. It's just throw away first round picks. It's throw away throw, throw away first round picks for a guy that said that he uh, uh uh we we held him back. Just throw it away for a guy that said that we were not going to win for 15 years. Just, just anybody, just anybody that can save us. And it's like, dude, come on, man. This ugh. 
God, hold on. Let's see if there's any others. Is this no music? Okay, that doesn't look impressive, but I promise it's impressive. Look at his handle. He's 6'10! I know, I know you're used to Wimby, okay? I know you're used to Wimby. You're like, this is nothing. You got a 7'5 uh, uh, guy. But this is a guy that can be slotted at small forward, and he's 6'10. Look at this. He's so good. The Lithuanian is so good. Lithuanian American is so good. Uh, yeah, guys, go go look into him. This is really just a, a hype him. And look at his fashion. It's awful, but still, guys, go go check him out, please. Go go to YouTube, go to Tubi TV, whatever you can do. All right, watch this kid play because he is absolutely phenomenal. And if the Spurs have, which is starting to look as if they would be able to get him, just do it. Just do it. I mean, you, you, give me some other names, by the way, guys. I'll tell you right now. I looked into Castle. I love uh, uh, Elliot Cadeau, but he probably won't be in this draft. Um, I'm loving this kid. Throw some names at me, please. Leave it in the comments. Tell me who you want me to check out. Uh, and if it's anything like this, I'm going to lose my mind, and I'm going to get even more angry that people are okay with getting rid of picks. Okay? I'm going to be very angry. Uh, <laughs> but, man, oh, man, so freaking impressed. Hold on. We're going to watch the rest of this. Look at him. He's listening to Eminem. I don't know if he is. Eminem is my favorite rapper. Look at that. Oh. Okay, what is he listening to? He's so saucy. He got the sweat. Oh, my God. Look at him. Okay, that's it. That's, that was the whole clip. Okay, all right. I'm sorry. This this had, I know this had no, like, no analysis of it, of, of anything. It's just me just getting excited because this dude is so freaking good. Um... Okay, so 44 weeks ago, he was projected number one pick of the 2024. Let's pray that he's not, okay? I hope his stock stays exactly where it is. Hold on, we're going we're gonna to look up NBA draft 2024 mock. Please, please be like seven so we can get you. Let's see. All right, five days ago. Okay, Alex Sar. I know everyone likes Alex Sar. I like Alex Sar too. That's another guy that I did know about. I did know about already. Uh, okay, there's Topic. Okay, I probably need to look into him. I don't know who that is. Cody Wood. Wait a minute. Where's J where's J where's J where's Jacoby? I like Jacoby. No, he's projected five. Okay, if the Spurs get the first overall pick, get him. I don't care. I don't care. Anyways, um, well, no, hold on. I want to see where Jacoby is. Because Jacoby's really good, too. Rob Dillingham, that's another good one. I did look into him. Sorry, I, I should have said more names. I love Jacoby. He's an eight. Okay. Where is... um? Where's the other one? Isaiah Collier. I don't really like Isaiah Collier. Um, like some people. I don't like his defense. Um, and I don't think he's creative enough around the rim. Oh, Stefan Castle's uh 16. Oh, he's really low. He's really low. Um, but his his defense is really good. Um, he's a really good facilitator and very smooth. Um getting to the rim. He can't shoot though. So you gotta work on that. Anyways, I'll give it you guys later. Oh my god, I'm so excited and I can't I cannot wait to watch uh him play in this next game. This upcoming no, hold on, we're gonna do one more. Do we look at this one? Look at look at that! Hold on, you guys missed it. Look. Come here. Come here, boy. Hold on. Come here. Okay. Any others? Unfortunately, I can't play it because they always have. He always have copyrighted me. Is he a rapper? He's a rapper. Look at him. Did we already look at this clip? Look at him. Oh, come here. Oh, give me that. Come here. Right there. He said, give me those cookies. Look at this. Bang. Come here, boy. Bang. Oh, oh, triple threat. Bang. He's so swag. Guys, I'm I'm losing it. This is who we get. Number one with the number one overall pick, the San Antonio Spurs select. Uh 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 Buzelis. I, I don't I don't care. He is so good. He is so good. All right, I'll give it to you guys later. Um I'm gonna watch a lot of a lot of games of his, a lot more games. I'm I'm actually upset with you guys for telling me to look at Collier when this this guy exists. Screw you. Um Bye.